The biggest barrier for me is planning video and measuring video holistically across all of the different channels that are out there in the marketplace. The marketplace continues to be more fragmented, new channels continue to get added every day and measurement is always lagging behind. There's always, you know, um, a couple years at least uh, lag time on measurement. So um, in terms of activating and trying to get, stay ahead of the marketplace, it becomes a challenge on you know, proving the impact and the effectiveness when measurement isn't really always caught up to uh, the marketplace. One of the most exciting times as a consumer where you have literally an infinite amount of choices in how you obtain your content, how you consume your content, and how you pay for your content. Uh, as an advertiser, it continues to be more complex um, as the um, environment gets more fragmented. So um, it, it's exciting and um, also overwhelming at the same time right now. Um, but I think the truth is, is that it's not going back to the old ways and it will continue to transform. And as an advertiser, um, continuing to stay informed of those changes and staying ahead of it um, is going to be increasingly important as the landscape continues to evolve. If there was a technology platform that existed that could absorb the entirety of the television, um, you know, buys in addition to all types of digital uh, buys together to be able to truly plan and measure holistically, um, I think that would be amazing. And I think there are promises of that existing today, but it's really um, about certain partners not necessarily being willing to give up their data to third parties. So it becomes um, interesting in theory. I don't know how realistic it will be um, to really absorb the entirety of the marketplace unless every partner is willing to give up a little bit in order to um, serve the greater good. I think one of the biggest challenges in the industry uh, that I work in in alcohol is um, just lack of first party data and that the retailers are really the ones that hold a lot of the purchase based data specifically and there's a lot of legal um, issues around um, having access to that data so therefore we have to rely on a lot of third party data um, whether that be um, through our DSP partners or different data partnerships and the further away um, it gets from you know our data, the, the more question there is and the more modeling that happens. So it just measurement overall and really attribution to sales becomes a bit of a challenge in our industry.